So this way you introduce a stochastic gradient descent method for machine learning. A regular gradient descent algorithm is inefficient because it requires a story gradient values for all training samples who improve computational efficiency, who improve the methods are used to compute the gradient of the loss function with respect to the model parameters W from the layer I to the layer G where arrow is the index of a layer, namely stochastic gradient descent and the mini batch gradient descent algorithms. In SGD, we randomly select a single sample from a training dataset to update the model parameters W here, where X is the input, Y is a corresponding label. The selected gradient may not be in the direction of convergence, and the converse directions are uncertain. The advantage is the faster convergence. The mini batch gradient descent algorithm is between SGD and GD algorithms, which improves the GD efficiency and the SGD convergence performance. Mini batch gradient descent algorithm randomly select M samples from the training dataset as a mini batch, which are used to determine the update the direction of model parameters W. Here we use the M gradients to update the model parameter W, which has a convergence performance between batch gradient descent and the stochastic gradient descent algorithms. Here we show the three passes by using one sample uh, mini batch samples and all the samples in the training data set. Suppose that there are n samples in the training data set. There are n minus m samples left in the training data set for the next iteration. The number of samples in training data set will become smaller after each iteration. This sampling method is a sampling without replacement. Another type of uh, sampling is uh, with replacement or independent, namely the samples will be put back to the training dataset after the current iteration, so that the training dataset keeps a constant scale. Experiments have uh, demonstrated that Sampling with a replacement has a better performance than sampling without a replacement. The model may select the same samples in the next iteration. However, the current model is different from the previous version, which will learn new information from the same samples. For example, this uh, samples are selected from a training data set. For sampling without replacement, for the next iteration, training data set contains less number of samples. In sampling with a replacement, after we samples from the training data set will pull them back to the training data set. So for the next iteration, the training data set will have the same number of samples. For more details, please check with these references. Thank you. Bye.